Hi friends, welcome to Learn and Explore. Today, in this video, I will going to discuss about layer command in AutoCAD. With the help of layer command, we can easily draw or manage our AutoCAD drawing. Okay, so here I am going to show you the layer command in AutoCAD and how it is used. Okay, this video is basically for the beginners of AutoCAD. Okay, here I am using AutoCAD version 2013 for layer command and you can use any version of AutoCAD for your layer command practice okay, or for your work. So here I am going to my AutoCAD interface and here you can see the layer command. So here it is the layer box. Okay. So it is the layer box where you can see all your status about the layers. Okay. This is layer control panel and uh, for layer command you just have to put LA or LA command here if you put it LA in your command bar automatically layer will appear and you just have to enter on it after entering this you can see this kind of dialog box here in your AutoCAD interface okay this dialog box is called layer properties manager which which is manage which manage all of your layer and this status okay here this icon is for new layer okay with the help of this icon if you click on it a new layer will appear here okay and this is for layer freeze and if you click on this cross mark your selected layer will be deleted okay you can't delete your zero layer because it is default layer okay and this tick sign is for setting your layer your layer in current position here you can see the status that means whether your layer is current or not you can check from here this is the name column this column is for creating new layer name okay if you want to create a new layer and you for naming that layer here this column is here here you can type because of this is zero layer you can't write it here you have to take a new layer and here you can write the name of the layer this is the layer on and off this is for layer on and off this is for freeze or unfreeze it this is for lock i will show all of the uses of this okay with proper drawings this for this with the help of this you can change your layer color okay and set it any color here you can set any color and uh, here the line type you can change the line type okay you can change the line type also you can change the line thickness also this this dialog box is for manages your layers okay so now here i am already created some layers okay see here this this drawing is completely on zero layer okay we here i'm just doing that take a line and simply take its options offset sorry okay so here if i click here you can see this is this all are in zero layers okay here you can see or you can open your control panel you all are in zero zero layers so we can change this layer into our record layers for that i just have to open the dialog box take a new layer called grid here i okay choose your own color any color you can choose 
okay and set it current just click on it and now this is your current layer that is grid and now the objects which you want to change their layer you have to select on it suppose here i am selecting this this lines okay so here i am selecting this all grid lines okay and here you can see the zero layers and i'm just going to my grid layer and just click on it and here you can see this layer this zero layers here this is the zero layers which i have not selected before and this all lines are converted into grid layer which were which are previously in zero layers okay so in this way you can convert your objects from one layer to another layer okay if you want to convert this layer into another layer suppose you want to convert it into suppose this okay you just have to click on it and now it is current you have to select and just click on it okay so here you can see this selected line are converted to another layer this way i am creating this layers this is three layer you can see this is pump this is sorry this is pond this is feature this is another okay so in this way i am just creating the different layers and now i'm going to show you the status i'm going status i'm explained name i'm explained and now this on off if you want to off only this color only this layer you just have to go on you just have to know the layer name that is dim and this is their color you just have to go on layer and just click on the layer off and click on it okay so here you can see that much of that much of lines are off okay and if you want to back them you just go that layer and click on and you can see all the lines are coming back okay so this is the use of layer on off and now freeze if you want to freeze the lines suppose this line you want to freeze if you want to freeze just going to la command and freeze that sorry freeze that layer you want to freeze and you can see all the lines are gone okay so this is kind of similar with layer on off okay so again it can refreeze in it and all the lines will back okay so next is so next is lock if you lock any command suppose if you lock here you can see both layers are here okay here two layers is here one is this dim layer as you can see one is grid layer and one is one is dim layer okay so now i am going to lay and lock all the dreams and also okay only dream, uh, one layer and here i am deleting we in here i am deleting all the grid layer okay by selecting one by one so if i select in this manner 
all line will be selected and if I click on delete all line only grid lines are deleted just because of this layer is locked so this is not deleted okay because this layer is locked if you want to delete this layer proper objects you have to unlock it going to your drawing and just delete so your layer will be deleted okay hope you understand how i am using this status name on freeze and lock command now color if you want to change color of any object in your layer suppose i want to change this color for my pump layer okay so here i'm just going to pump layer click on the color and i'm just choosing any color okay and here you can see the color is changed okay and if any thing i am drawing this and the color will be this only so i take it in pump layer okay so now the line type suppose i am here the line type is continuous if I draw any line in DIM, it will be in continuous line. Okay. But if I want to change the line type, I have to go just LA going to continuous. Suppose any line type you can load from here. Any line type you can load from here. Okay. And you just have to choose that. LA and OK. If you change the line type, here your line type will also change. And if you draw a new line, that line will also be in that line type. OK. So, in this manner, you can use or manage all of your layer options and you can use this in your AutoCAD drawing with the help of layer you can draw your you can draw very quickly and very manageable process manageably of your drawings hope you understand how I am using this layer comments and how it is used in your AutoCAD. Okay, hope you understand. If any question is arise there, please feel free to ask and I will try to answer you all. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Thank you.